Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Tanelia and this is Uyong Beauty. In this video, we're going to be doing another Shop Miss A unboxing. I think I uploaded the last one last week maybe, so it's not been that long since I did one. But like I said in that video, I was waiting for some... I had just made an order because I was waiting for some items to come back in stock as far as like makeup and stuff so that I can film a trying on new makeup from Shop Miss A haul. So we're going to go in ahead and open this up. I love the way Shop Miss A packages everything in this like big bubble wrap envelope. So I'm just going to kind of reach in here and slowly pull things out one at a time. This haul is it's not huge so I should be able to get through it pretty quickly. Okay it looks like there is an envelope inside the bubble wrap envelope here. All right, we have made it to the inner packaging. Now let me open this up. I tell you, one cannot say that Shop Miss A does not make sure that their packaging is adequately sealed. So there's my receipt right there. So the first thing I got is this little headband. I thought this was so cute. It's very, very soft and fluffy. It has this cute little bow. I thought that was super adorable. This is so soft. And then I got this necklace. I will drop in some b-roll so you guys can kind of see everything up close. Like I said in my, I think it's a kombucha video, I've been wanting to try out more jewelry because I'm sure you guys noticed I don't really wear hardly any jewelry at all. So I've been wanting to bring in more jewelry into my collection, into my wardrobe. That is a really, really pretty just kind of a blue. Looks like it has um, like turquoisey detail. I love silver jewelry too. I'm not a big fan of gold. I don't feel like gold looks really good against my skin tone, but I love the way silver looks. And I just thought that was so pretty. Next, I got this metal hair clip. I absolutely love hair clips. It's nice quality. And it looks kind of like a seashell. I thought that was super, super cute. That is really good quality. That is like not cheap. Like that's not something you would find at the Dollar Tree. That is really nice. I grabbed, I think just one sheet mask. I think so. This is the Charcoal Essence Sheet Mask. So this has enriched charcoal extract and various nutritive components that deliver abundant moisture and nourishment deep into your skin. I absolutely love sheet masks. This is from the Esfolio brand. So that's what that looks like. I'm going to throw that in my little collection of sheet masks. I grabbed two of the Argan Oil Brush Soaps. I love these. I'm currently using one right now about halfway through. These are my absolute favorite brush soaps. These are $1.55. 55 goes to one of the charities. It's Charity Edition. I'm not exactly sure which charity it is, but this is part of their Charity Editions. It smells so good. What you do is you take your brush, you wet it, and then you just kind of sweep it over the soap, lathers up. It cleans the brushes so well. I also like using my sponges. This works really, really well to clean my makeup sponges as well. And it gets them very clean. It conditions them. I absolutely love these. And I got this really cute Hello Kitty keychain. We absolutely love anything Hello Kitty in this house. This is pretty heavy duty. And as you can see, there's Hello Kitty's face. It has like little diamond detail in it. It's just so pretty. So one thing about Shop Miss A is they add new items to their website daily. So you could go in there today and see, you know, this set of items and then check again tomorrow and they've listed like five, ten new items on their website. They're always adding new items. I grabbed a couple of mascaras. These are some of the things I was waiting to come back into stock because I wanted to do a trying on new makeup. The very first time they came out, they sold out like really, really quickly and I wasn't able to get them. And so when I saw them restocked, I grabbed them up. And you guys, this is a heavy duty packaging like this does not feel cheap this is the spider lash mascara i think this one is from malibu glitz yet yeah, it's from malibu glitz it has two sides on it this was one of the things i was very excited about when it finally came in stock i grabbed it this one is also from malibu glitz it is a scandalous eyes reloaded mascara and i think this was the volumizing this may be the curl and volumizing they have like different formulas that you could choose from yeah, this one is the extreme volume so interested in seeing what that's going to be like 
like. Obviously, I cannot use both of these at the same time, so more than likely, I will use this one first and then try this one out later. Then I grab a couple of lipsticks. I think I just grabbed two. Nope, there's three. I have been wanting to try out more bullet lipstick formulas. If you've been following my channel, then you know that I my lip formula of preference, as it were, has always been liquid lips, but I've been wanting to get more into bullet style lip, uh, lipsticks, especially as we're going into the cooler months. So I grabbed three lipsticks from the website. These two are from the AOA brand. AOA is the Shop Miss A brand. I think their main brand. The, and then there's like other brands on the website as well. This shade is in Bliss. Oh, there's plastic on the outside. I'm over here trying to get this little tag off. The whole thing is covered in plastic. All I need to do is... Sorry about that. I got a uh, telemarketer phone call there. I thought I turned off my notifications. Hold on just a minute. I don't know. Okay, so this one looks like it's more... Okay, it has, it has a sweet scent to it, but this one is kind of a nude peach kind of a tone. I still have some stuff on my hand from my previous unboxing. Hold on just a moment. Let me take that off my hand so my hand is nice and clean for swatches. So this shade is Bliss and looks like it's a kind of a pinky, not peachy, a pinky nude. I like how creamy the formula feels. So that's what that one looks like. I have a bunch of bullet lipsticks from Milani in my Ulta cart right now. I just haven't checked out yet. And I also have some in my boxy pop-up box um, cart as well, in the boxy pop-up store. Just really wanting to try out, you know, some new formulas and kind of get out of my comfort zone. This shade is in Reef. This one is kind of a corally nude shade. I thought this one was so pretty. These are so creamy in the way that they feel, the texture. Yeah, I definitely love that one. That is so pretty. And then I grab the, what is this, the Lip Pop. Let me see if there is an actual shade name. The shade name is number six Sorbet. I just really liked the packaging. It has this, the Eiffel Tower on it. Very Paris looking. And this one is more of a kind of a red coral. Very, very pretty. This formula feels a little bit thicker than the AOA, but it's still very pretty. So we have that shade. Yeah, I'm very excited about trying out, you know, new lipstick formulas. I grabbed some eyelash adhesive, although I'll be absolutely honest, I thought that this was in the little uh, tube with the wand. I didn't realize that it, this is how it came. So I'm a little disappointed in that. The formula might be just fine, but yeah, it's not what I was expecting. But if it's a good formula, this may be something I can just throw in my makeup bag, you know, to like reapply lashes or something if I, you know, need to throughout the day. Then we have this elephant anklet. This one I will definitely more than likely have to uh, take some b-roll for you guys to be able to see. My daughter loves elephants. They are, are her absolute favorite animal in the entire universe of animals. They are her spirit animal. She absolutely adores them. She has so many elephant related items. So when I saw Shop Miss A add this to their new um, items, I definitely had to get it. Now is it the highest quality product? No, but I just thought it was so pretty. It has these little elephants on it. Yeah, I would definitely be dropping in some b-roll here so you guys can better see it. But it has like diamond, you know, faux diamond detail and it has the little elephants all over it. I just think it's so cute. I know my daughter's gonna love it. She absolutely, like I said, she adores elephants. I have a few more items in here. Well, two more items. I grabbed this earring set. I've also been wanting to get into earrings. When I was going through their jewelry section, a lot of the products that I wanted to try were sold out. That's the one thing about Shop Miss A too. A lot of the products will sell out pretty quickly. But you can put in your email and they will send you a notification once everything restocks. I thought, those are so pretty. And these actually have a pretty good weight to them. These are really nice. These little silver detail butterfly earrings. Those are pretty. And the last thing I picked up, this is from Muse. It is a blush and glow. And what it is, there's a blush on it and then there's a highlighter. This is not like a new product. This has been on their website for a while now, but it's been one of the things I've been wanting to try. So this will definitely be in that shop, that uh, shop Miss A makeup video. That's what it looks like. I am going to swatch these because I want to see like what the shade looks like, what the formula looks like. It's a very corally shade. Does it say what the actual shade looks like? It just says number five. So there's not like an actual shade listed. 
it. Let me see here. Okay, the blush feels very, very soft. It feels very silky. It looks like there's a decent amount of pigment to it. Oh, definitely. Oh, that is very, very pigmented. That is very pretty. And of course, you know, the burnt orange coral type shades. They speak to my orange loving soul. I'm going to go ahead and swatch the highlighter as well. Not super, super creamy, but it does feel kind of smooth. This one is more of a kind of a brassy, bronzy kind of a tone. So that is what the highlighter looks like. It's not super smooth, but I do like that tone. It's very metallic looking. I'm sure on the actual cheekbones, it's going to look absolutely beautiful. So there's everything that I got in this haul. As you can see, it wasn't very big. It'll probably be a little while before I do another one. I am wanting to get some more of their jewelry items and stuff, but like I said, they sell out pretty quickly. Especially the silver ones is what I noticed. They'll be like, the gold ones will still be in stock, but the silver ones won't be. So I'm guessing the silver is the more popular of the two. You will definitely be seeing one of the mascaras, the lippies, and the little blush and highlighter in a trying new makeup video from Shop Miss A coming up. I think I'm going to film that on Friday. Today is Tuesday, August 17th, so yeah. I think I'm going to film that on Friday and probably get that one up over the weekend. But that is everything in this haul. If you guys like these types of videos, be sure to give it a thumbs up. It really does help my channel. If you're new to my channel, not already subscribed, I would love it if you would consider joining the family. And if you'd like to be notified of any videos maybe coming up in the future, just be sure to tap the notification bell down below. You'll be notified each and every time. Be safe, guys. Take care of yourself, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.